To create a purchase order, click Purchase Orders from the home screen. Select a supplier or add a new one. If you already have the supplier's invoice number, you can enter it here. Otherwise, you can enter it later. The order date can be changed if necessary. Check the Capricorn box if you have a Capricorn account and this purchase order will be included on your Capricorn statement. You can now enter the barcode of any parts or services you want to quickly add to the order. You can also add items by dropping down the type box and selecting a part or sublet to add. Change the quantity and prices as required, keeping in mind you can swap between displaying GSD inclusive and exclusive prices using the drop down menu. The default for this can be changed in your workshop mate settings. Delete an item by pressing the cross for deletion on the right hand side of each item. If you'll be charged for freight, you can enter the freight charge here. The rounding field can be used to account for any minor discrepancies between your supplier's rounding and your own to achieve the correct grand total of the invoice. Any notes relevant to this particular order can be entered here. These will be included on the printed or emailed purchase order. Clicking Save Order will allow you to print or email the PO to the supplier or anyone else, and add a payment. When the items and or tax invoice has been received, you'll click the Receive button and the part stock levels will increase accordingly. If any amendments are required, the Amend button will allow you to make changes before saving the PO again.